Another huge key to motivation is expectancy. You have to believe that not only is it possible for you, but that you can do it, that you have the personal control, the self-reliance, the autonomy, the thing that says, you know what? I believe in my ability to figure this out, and I know I can move forward with this. You should expect your dreams to happen, and you should expect that you have strength and the confidence to make them happen. Stop listening to naysayers, to negative and pessimistic people that try to wear you down and start expecting you can and you will achieve your goals. You have to really believe in yourself deep down inside. Focus, the blueprint for architect's house design or the author's table of contents. You can't build a house without a plan. So start setting goals. Goals and make plans for how you're going to achieve them. One of the best feelings in the world is when you get to tick off something from your goal list and say, I did it, I accomplished it. So always stay focused on what you have to do to achieve your goals. Another key aspect that ties into focus is effort. There's no point in setting goals if you don't make an effort to achieve them. You have to work and you have to work hard. That's the secret to success. So put effort into turning your dreams into reality because that's how you create momentum. And we all know that once you get momentum, you get hope, you get motivation, and everything feels easier. Be mindful of your attitude. Always remind yourself that your attitude changes the way you see the world like a lens or a pair of glasses. If you walk through life being cynical and pessimistic with a defeated attitude, you can't expect to reach the next level in your life. Change your belief system. Change your lens. Dare to think this is going to be a good day. I can grow today. I can make an impact today. I can get things done today. And last but not least, your environment is very important when it comes to motivation. Of course you feel disappointed when you share your deepest dreams and desires to someone. Who wouldn't feel like that? You have to free yourself from negative influences at all costs. Start spending more time with great people. Make a conscious effort to surround yourself with positive, nourishing, and uplifting people who believe in you, encourage you to go after your dreams, and who applaud your victories. Don't expect everyone to understand and support you, but surround yourself with people that do. It will make all the difference in the world. Congratulations on your commitment to your personal mastery and staying motivated to live the life of your dreams. Thank you.